guys, I apologize for the glare. Hope you all are uh, forgiving about that. Uh, before we start the video, I did want to give a shout out to Nathan Oda and his uh, Kickstarter project, Together Alone. Uh, so I'm looking at his Kickstarter page right now. He has $3,515 out of his $12,100 goal. Uh, he has 35 backers currently, and he has 23 more days to get it. So we need to help this guy out and get him to where he needs to be so he can get his book published. Uh, so I'll read you guys a little bit of the story section to get a bit of an idea of what this Together Alone book is about. Since in the last shout out I didn't really get to explain it all that well. Well, this time around, for those who are interested and want to know, I'll give you guys a quick read on this story. So, this says, Over the past five years, I have been on an intense journey to discover and understand who I am. Throughout the ups and downs, the laughter and the tears, I have captured every moment and every thought. I used my creative nature and my skills with a camera and a pen and I put everything into the form of one single book, Together Alone. It is the most honest look into my deepest thoughts and my most, I'm sorry, I can't read that word, visceral emotions. I'm sorry if I biffed that one, Nathan, I'm sorry. <laughs> anyway, I made beautiful in its artistic form. The pictures and poems between these pages were made for a very specific reason. I know how I know exactly how scary, confusing, and challenging it is to dig into the deepest part of parts of yourself by putting my own journey out there for all of you to experience in its most raw truth, holding nothing back. I am encouraging you to dig deep into yourself. As a self-aware artist who is obsessed with internal conflict, I understand just how reviving it can be to feel that someone relates with you. Feel my pictures as a connection. Read my words can be and be inspired. And then after that, you can scroll down and you can read like a little bit of his poem. He has pictures and uh, little bits of his poems throughout the pictures that you can see. Um, all right, so this is all the stuff I just read for you guys. Sorry if the screen's kind of crappy, but uh, like right here, you can get some of your uh, pictures and your poems. And this is a very professional, very well written book. All the pictures that he took and edited and every single poem that's in this book he thought of and wrote himself. I know this is a bit of a long introduction for a shout out in a video and this is not sponsored. I'm not being paid for any of this. This is just something that I want to do out of kindness and support for this guy. So please, if you guys can, please go to Together Alone on Kickstarter and pledge. He is getting very close to being halfway. Um, I need to back this project myself, so maybe I'll be doing that here shortly. Um, but please, share this with your friends, even if you can't donate money on your own. Um, whoever backs this project will get a limited edition version of this book signed by Nathan himself, I'm pretty sure. So uh, please help support this guy. He is a very nice gentleman. Uh, he is a very uh, caring and open individual, obviously, since he worked so hard to do this. So, uh, alright guys, let's get to the video. Oops, Speckham Auto is back with a video today. Let me turn this AC fan down. I hope it doesn't cause too much wind noise, guys. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to do a pretty short video. Uh, really doesn't have much to do with cars today. Um, the only thing I have planned today, really, is I'm going to take this car real quick through a car wash. 99% of the time, I will wash this car by hand with the self-service car wash. But today, I'm just running it through the... Uh, touchless automatic tunnel I just I don't feel like it today it's just way too hot for this I'm tired I'm not up for it so the plans for today is obviously take this car for the car wash which is what I'm doing right now then 
I'm going to tell you guys about a couple pieces of new equipment I got for my channel. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. Y'all probably know what it is because I complained about it in the last couple of videos. But I got a couple different pieces of equipment. I really want to eventually get audio equipment, like a, uh, like a little one of those uh, microphones that you clip to your shirt. I want to get one of those eventually because I know half the time the audio on my camera right now is just a hunk of crap. But, hey, I'm still enjoying what I have and I don't really get much complaints about it. Also, sorry if the camera is shaky. I have a really bad car mount, so forgive me. We're going to take this uh, baby to the car wash. Then we're going to pull her over, and I'll show you all my new equipment that I got. All right, let's get to it, guys. All right, guys. Luckily, we live not very far from the car wash, obviously. Huge shout-out to Mr. Froggy's Car Wash for being the best number one car wash in Lancaster, Ohio. That's right, guys. If you guys want a real good car wash, come the froggies i always go into the self uh the self wash ones there the two little tunnels at the end they have a touchless automatic for 24 hours a day and then they have an express car wash where you have men uh washing the cars for you uh so here we go guys touchless automatic let's go can see but when you get the ultimate car wash you get the uh, pre-sell triple foam clear coat surface protectant and the spot free wrench to uh, finish it off it's now doing the uh, spot free wrench I know it's kind of hard to see it out the window due to the uh, uh, water on the window sorry about that guys but uh, here's the spot free wrench I don't think you guys really care too much for this part I guess you can see this little water show but other than that, we're about done here. Alrighty guys, the uh, car wash is now complete. The car's dry for the most part. Again, thank you to Froggy's Car Wash in Lancaster for doing such a wonderful job with their very fantastic equipment. 
now we shall continue to our next destination and talk about our new equipment alrighty guys here's the final result fresh out of the car wash she's as clean as ever I'm not gonna waste too much time going around just wanted to show you guys the you know how good even the automatic touchless car wash this place does that is great results alrighty so now we're gonna come over here we're gonna set up at this table and I'll show you these new pieces of equipment I've gotten from a very special individual alrighty so here is the new equipment that I got these two very very nice tripods we'll start with the small guy here so here I have this uh, flexible tripod it's good for photography and videography uh, it has flexible legs so you can mount it to stuff and wrap it and stuff uh, it's also good for it has a cell phone mount a CLR camera mount and a GoPro mount which I seriously hope I get a GoPro soon. I still don't know when I'm getting a GoPro. If any of you guys don't know yet, I use my cell phone as the camera for this channel, which is a uh, Samsung Galaxy Note 8. So it's not only a cell phone, but it's also a phone that's a few generations old. Um, so with this, uh, I obviously have the mounts, and this little, this little mount here is kind of neat because it has this little ball where you can move it to whatever direction you want it to be in you have your little GoPro CLR mount you have your little controller that you can connect via Bluetooth so you can uh, if you want to take pictures or something you can uh, stand away from the camera you don't need a photographer you can just uh, click the button and it'll take your picture no problem so very awesome I think I should probably also demonstrate the flexi legs here kind of give you guys an idea of just how flexible these legs are very 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 amazing I love this tripod and then we got this tall guy right here believe it or not this is actually the highest tallest setting that you can have on this tripod in particular imagine if the camera was mounted up here it would be this high off the ground and mind you this tripod is even taller than me this tripod is probably about six foot tall so maybe five foot eleven I don't know but it's a pretty freaking tall tripod like I literally have to reach up to touch the top just a little bit but here we have that. I'll show you a few cool things about it. This tripod here has these little... Damn it, camera. Focus. Focus. Uh, sorry if you guys can't see it clearly, but it has these cool little... Uh, uh, things here that make it to where you know for sure your tripod is balanced. Then up here you have another one another level is what they call it sorry guys I'm not all there today I'm trying to get you guys a good decent video in but yeah we got a we got a level for this part of the tripod and we also have a level for the D tripod legs itself see as you can see we're on a hill so it's not level but if you tilt it just a hair or three now it's level and obviously it's the legs are not all touching the ground but that's that's perfectly fine and then we have this little uh, nifty handle here so you can just pick up the tripod and believe it or not this thing is very lightweight this probably only honestly it feels like it's probably only like maybe five pounds it's extremely light for something that's taller than me 
And there's a cool little nifty hook down here. I guess it's so you can put something that's weighted on there and it's supposed to keep your tripod stable from wind and other nuisances, I suppose. But uh, we're gonna put this stuff away, show you guys the box for the little tripod and this really, really nice bag for the big one. I guess it's called Exit. I don't know. I'm not a tripod expert, but these are some really good tripods. I'm very, very honored and extremely blessed and privileged to have these tripods. Some people are like, it's just a fucking tripod. Why are you so fucking excited about it? Because I haven't really been able to make any videos. My uh, Sunbeam uh, tripod, as you guys already know, broke to complete pieces so uh yeah i didn't have a tripod for a good minute and now i do so i got this tripod behind me and this uh little flexi bull guy down here extremely excited now i could finally start making some pretty decent quality content again uh when the opportunity comes i'm definitely gonna take it I've been hesitant with doing videos and just haven't been as active with it because I mean why am I going to drop videos that well, I don't even have a freaking tripod the, the, the content quality is going to be trash you know and I don't want people to see my channel as just pure trash I mean if you like my videos hell yeah you know all the love the world to you man or ma'am which if you're a female or male cool really appreciative of everybody here and if you dislike the videos that I make for any reason, if you don't like the content that I make, then, hey, it's okay. I'm not going to be mad. I'm not going to be upset. You know, it's, it's people have different opinions, and that's perfectly okay. Now I'm going to start wrapping this up. I'll be right back shortly. Alrighty, guys, so as you can see, new tripods in action. I'm using the taller one right now to show you guys this, uh, little bit of footage here. I really want to give Nathan Oda a huge shout out for this uh, tripod and the other tripod. I want to thank him very much. And y'all are probably wondering, well, how, how, much did, how much did you pay him for this uh, tripod set? To be honest with you guys, I, I honestly paid nothing for it. I got it for free. Uh, he messaged me one day after I posted my last video he was like, I have a couple of tripods that you can have. And I said, oh, really? That's cool. Um, uh, I really need some tripods. How much, how much do you want for them? He said, nothing. Just come pick them up. I'm like, oh, shit, really? Am I, am I, am I reading this shit right? Am I reading this right? Free tripods. This is a lot of money and equipment. I mean, you, you did not have to do this. I'm still blown away it's been days now since you gave me this stuff and I'm still absolutely blown away um, thank you so so much Nathan again huge shout out to you huge shout out to your book together alone you're over was it three or four thousand dollars now you're getting really closer 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 to your goal I seriously hope you make it Nathan I'm really happy for you and I cannot thank you enough for these tripods. It makes video content so much better. And I couldn't have been able to do this without you. Thank you so much, Nathan. Thank you so much. Alrighty, guys. I'm going to go ahead and uh, wrap up this video. Let's take old Shadow here for a nice little ride before I go back home. Don't forget to leave a like, share the video, and subscribe to my channel for more content. Follow my Instagram page at Speckham Auto. I'm also on Facebook, Speckham Auto on YouTube. Have yourselves a good day, guys. Have yourself a good week. Stay safe out there, and I'll see you all next time.